वेलकम टू अवर चैनल माय नेम इज निकिता फ्रॉम बीएसपी सॉल्यूशन इन टुडेज ट्यूटोरियल आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन हाउ वी कैन प्रोसेस द क्विक पे इन ऑरेकल सो व्हाट सिंपलीफाइड क्विक पे डस इट रन्स द क्विक पे प्रोसेसेस एंड डिस्प्ले द स्टेटमेंट ऑफ अर्निंग इट इंक्लूड टास्क फॉर कैलकुलेटिंग पेरोल रन रिजल्ट प्रोसेस न्यू हायर और टर्मिनेशन पेमेंट्स pay people whose record you remove from the standard run for further processing and perform a special payments and also resolve localized problem with the payroll run that required reprocessing so let's move on to the application where we can see how to process the quick pay here under the my client group you have the option of payroll click on it and under this you have flow submission and result option here you can see the simplified quick pay option click on it here search for the person here search uses today date so it display the current pay period the period name is derived from the effective date and based on that date the date earned and process date are automatically defaulted so under the standard earnings i can decide which element i want to process or click the select all to process all of them and if i need more help uh, with the list of element shown here i can also use the show filter option there are several filters option including the employment level creator type the entries entry type and element classification so now here i add the element for this employee so i just click on the add option here search for the element name which i want to add i select the bonus pay here once i selected the bonus i can see the assignment element is assigned again so then i click on the continue option here i will enter the amount of this bonus first confirm the effective start date uh, is correct and if i was entering a recurring element there would not be an end date because it would process each period until an end date was entered but since this was the non recurring element the effective end date is automatically populated because it only runs for this one pay period let's enter the bonus amount now just submit the quick pay so this is the element we just added here let's click on the submit option to submitting the quick pay
the quick pay is submitted successfully here i can see the statements of earnings and the employee tax deduction the pre tax deduction and employer contribution here and if i need to i can drill down for even more details here here you can see the gross to net earning the employee tax deduction pre tax deduction so these are the detail we can see here and at this point if i wanted to pay to this employee i do run additional process such as the calculate quick pay pre payments pay slip etc uh, but uh, since i only wanted to confirm the calculation i'm going to delete the quick pay click on the action button and then click on the delete option so this is how we can process the quick pay in oracle payroll i hope it is clear to you thank you so much for the watching